Hi everyone, welcome back to another interview series. My name is Meher from Newfoundland and Labrador. And today I have the privilege to interview Daniel Potero from Orlando. Hi Daniel, how are you doing? I'm doing fantastic, thanks for having me. Thank you for being here and you are my last guest of 2023. So let's rock this interview. So Daniel, he knows how to help STEAM students land their job, their dream job, all within 90 days of graduation without applying to hundreds of companies. And if he fails, you don't have to pay him. So that's great. We'll talk about that. Uh, so when it comes to job searching, he knows that job seekers want to be confident about their approach and ultimately get an offer from one of their dream companies. And he understands how overwhelming and intimating job search can be because he has been in that place. So we'll talk about that also. And this is why he is proud to say that he has helped thousands of individuals land job offers from top companies. And also he's the CEO and co-founder of OpenIt. So Daniel, let's start from the overwhelming part because you've been there and I feel that if someone doesn't go through, they will not understand the stress and the anxiety from job searching. So how can job seekers stay positive during that job search from applying, networking, meeting people? How can they stay positive? You know, I think the key thing to understand is that job searching is like very similar to any other goal that you achieve. Mm -hmm. And there's a cycle, right? There's a cycle yeah. of not knowing what to do, of there's a learning curve. And so you're going to go through that emotional roller coaster that you go through when you're trying to accomplish something big. Yes. And at least when I, m most of my clients, they're college students, they're about to graduate. They've gone through that cycle before that stress of not knowing what they're going to do after, after high school and what college they're going to go to. And so what I try to remind their, 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 my, my clients, my mentees is you've gone through failures and journeys before and yes. you've overcame them and you just have to believe in yourself because it's going to happen. You know, yeah. it's, it, it's going to be really impossible for you to go from the time you graduate to retire when you're 65 without a job, you're going to get a job. Yeah. It's a matter of when, and it's an emotional roller coaster. So just stay positive. And it's important to keep like notes of other things that you're most proud of. Like when you graduated college, when you got an A in that class, that was really, really tough. Or, you know, break it down to if you play sports when you want something. So re go and remind yourself of the things mm -hmm. you've already accomplished. Because yeah. by the time you've already graduated college, you've accomplished hundreds, thousands of things. And this yeah. is just one more goal that you're, you're going to conquer. It's just a matter of time. Time. And when I tell my clients or the students I'm helping is that have a schedule. So maybe Monday morning, you're commenting. Maybe Tuesday morning, you are applying for a job. Tuesday afternoon, maybe you're going for an informative session. Maybe take the Wednesday off and then Thursday morning, go for a gym. And if you have any interviews, uh, uh, celebrate those small success and not just focus 24 hours in front of the computer. Do you have any similar way in terms of goal setting or what is your approach yeah so I, i'm huge in goal setting and i'm huge in more than anything on prioritization there's this beautiful video uh if you google it i wish i would have came up with it but it, I, I can't take credit for it it's professor where it says golf uh, or ten, uh, golf balls rocks gravel mm -hmm. sand and corona and this video he talks about understanding what your big rocks are Right. Okay. And so if there's a jar that you have to fill, if you put the sand and a bottle of Corona first, the, the golf balls and the gravels don't don't fit. Mm -hmm. But if you, if you put your big rocks, the most important things. Right. So like job searching, finishing, you know, your family, you know, all the things that are important. And then you put the little rocks. They fit in between the golf balls and then the sand fits in between the rocks mm -hmm. and so on. And so like the way I tell our our, our my employees my mentees is you, if you make everything a priority, nothing's a priority. So pick three things mm -hmm. that are a priority to you to, for you to accomplish in the next quarter, right? In the next 12 weeks, we, as humans, we're, we're terrible at projecting long-term. Yes. Overestimate what we can do in a year and underestimate what we can do in a lifetime. And so think about the next 12 weeks and what are your top three priorities? Job searching, 
let's say if you're still in school, I work with a lot of students graduating and then family and friends. Yeah. And this, this little AI thing keeps on throwing balloons and stuff. <laughs> and so, and then from there, you schedule your big rocks first. So to your point, you yeah. want to schedule it. So schedule your classes. You can't change your classes. Yeah. From there, schedule your time for job searching. Then schedule your time to like, you know, if you love video games, if that's your mental thing, if you love sports, schedule yeah. your gym, like, you know, like working out, schedule your gym time for your health. Yes. And then after that, because your calendar will be like 80% full, then let people put things into your calendar. Then you can do your things. Then you can go mm -hmm. to Taco Tuesday and so on. Yeah, those are great tips, Daniel. Thank you very much. So for the audience watching or listening for the first time, I'm going to ask Daniel a couple of questions and I'm going to post them on a daily basis. Kind of a journey with us the whole week. You can like, share, put comments. So tune in next time for another great question with Daniel. Mm -hmm.